Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another video and welcome back to another Brick in the Mall. Uh, Alright, first off I would like to say a couple things kind of related to this game, but also kind of unrelated to it. It all ties in together to some degree, so don't worry about it. Um, first off, again, I'd like to apologize for missing more content uh, yesterday and um, the days before that. Um... I know I said this in yesterday's um, Brick in the Mall episode, but I feel the need to say it again because I, I missed more content yesterday. Um, and there's no excuse for it. I'm not going to not gonna create one for you um, or for myself. Um, it's, it's not right that I'm missing content like this, uh, especially when we have some newcomers to the channel. Um, you know, I've seen some... Uh, some uh, some new subscribers come in, which is very awesome. Welcome to the channel, if you're watching. Um, and uh, I've also noticed that, like, the viewership has been awesome on uh, some of the latest content. You know, Brick in the Mall is doing even better than it was before. Um, that Bohemian Killing video I put out did well, for my standards. This is all for my standards, you know. Not for, like, you know, fucking... Markiplier with where he has like well, I don't know twenty million subs or something. These they're for my standards, my standards. Um, so the channel is doing well right now, and that makes me feel ten times worse about missing content because the channel's doing that much better, and I I'm just like, you know, I'm not getting shit done, and that's not cool. Gotta, I, I gotta get that stuff done. I gotta be able to, um, to put out content on a regular basis. Um, I gotta get back into the swing of things because, you know, I we got new people on the channel or in the community, and uh, I don't want to disappoint. And uh, obviously, missing content is disappointing. So I'm gonna stop doing that, um, or at least try to. Um, but uh, again, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Uh, greatly appreciate you uh, checking out my content. Uh, I hope that I'm as intent and oh, wow. I hope as I hang on. I hope I'm as entertaining as you want me to be. There we go. That's how I wanted to phrase it. it took me a couple tries. You know, I'm it's 9:30 in the morning. <laughs> it's a little. Uh, it's a little uh, rough trying to get myself to talk normally. Um, but another thing I wanted to bring up before we actually commence anything is that a new update came out for this game. And there were a bunch of things changed that I can't really remember um, because they were not necessarily insignificant. They just weren't as significant as the real main point of the update, I think. Um... And the update added rats to the game. So if there are floor, floor tiles that are left dirty or there is trash left laying around for an extended period of time because your janitors don't get to it, then um, eventually rats will come and they will invade the entire store that they are in. And then your builders have to come in and exterminate um, once they are in there. So... That's a little, uh, what are you doing? You, you gotta, yeah, get, clean this up. I don't want rats. This is my only fucking store. I don't want rats coming in and making me lose even more money. Um, so that's another thing to worry about. Um, although, as long as I handle it right, as long as I always have enough janitors to cater to the amount of stores that I have, I think I should be okay. I think I should be okay. Um, hopefully, anyway. Because I, I don't want to, you know, risk anything. I don't want I don't want to even see a rat invasion occur. Like, I just don't want it. It does not seem like a good time. Um, Alright, so what are we going to do today? I don't know. Do we have to wait for more stuff? Uh, well, I mean, this kind of... Gives us a lot of stuff. That reminds me. They actually changed something in here. 
So like something with demand, they they added like a third tier to it or something. I don't really understand that because I didn't even know there was a tier system in place to begin with, but apparently there is. Um, so great. <laughs> I mean, I, I I don't know. It said that this new change would um, this new change would create more demand for like specialty stores, which I've done like in the previous shopping center. Like if I were to sell only alcohol at a given store, let's say, um, then it would do better because um, because there would be more demand for it. I think I think that's how that works. I have no idea. All right, I I looked through, kind of skimmed the the uh, the update log. Um, okay, uh, I skimmed through the update log. And uh, kind of tried to pick up as much as I could without doing real extensive reading. Um, and that's kind of what I picked up on. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, you know, because I, I feel like I'm probably wrong, um, you know, down in the comment section below. And in fact, if I get stuff wrong in general, tell me. Because I don't, I don't want to continue spewing lies and whatnot if I'm wrong. You know, so aside from that, though, uh, do we do we do we build uh, another store? I don't, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe another like an, an alcohol based store, but see, I don't know. Beer is almost taken care of in terms of demand. Wine, not so much. Liquor, not so much. But there's not enough there for me to want to put in a an alcohol based store all of this stuff though i can s sell in a given store it'll kind of be like a specialty store not exactly like one but it'll kind of be like one and i think that's what we're gonna do and it's not gonna be a massive store by any means because we don't need it to be but It's going to be big enough. So they're going to work on that. And this is going to cost us a lot more money. But we need more than one store in here. Because this store loses us money. Apparently. I'm not really sure why. Um, it might just be because of the amount of people we have working at any given time. You know. We have like... Let's see. like We have like... 18 employees in total, which does not sound like a lot, um, you know, even for a given store, like a grocery store, well, might be a normal amount, I don't know, um, but it's, it's very, it's very costly to have that many people working, um, so, I don't know, I gotta figure something out for that store, I don't know what I'm gonna do, but, I gotta think of something. Oh wait, I gotta put it in the walls first. Uh, we'll do it like right here. We'll do it like this. There we go. There we go. Then we'll have the staff door right there and the big old double door right here. Actually, should I put in a single door? It's too late. I don't really care anyway. <laughs> it doesn't make a huge difference. In fact, I don't think it makes any difference. It's just cosmetic. Alright, so they're gonna take care of that and then we'll get everything set up. And this is gonna be one of those stores that's open from like nine to five. It's not gonna be open. Um Hey, you guys didn't finish this. You guys gonna come over and finish this? Yeah, thank you. Um it's not going to be one of those stores that's open for a real long period of time. Uh, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Checkout counters. Uh, yeah, we'll put them here, I guess. Can I fit this? Yeah, I can. Nice. All right, so we'll have three. 
uh, which means we'll only need to hire three cashiers, which would be cost effective for us. Uh, okay, so we need a bunch of shelves then for what we're selling. I see, I don't know how much I want to sell here. Like, do I want to sell, um, do I want to offer a lot or do I want to offer a smaller amount? And I don't know. It's kind of a, well, wait, let's see. Let me count here real quick what I'm going to be selling at this store. We're not going to be selling car tools there. That just doesn't make any sense. Um, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, light bulbs, though. No, eight. Um, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, so we'll need like fourteen shelves. And then if we double that, I think. I mean, oh, I don't know. I don't really know how I want to do this. Uh, one, two, okay, we got nine so far. I think I want 28 shelves. Or, you know, whatever is closest to that number. So that's 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. And we'll go 29 because, you know, we got to make it look even. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's not what I wanted to do. Also, I got to do this. That reminded me I got to nail this. Kind of knock this out real quick. There we go. Uh, we're going to go in here, and uh, we're going to assign you to storage, and then we're going to call you... Uh, duh, well, let's see here. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> um, home and beauty. Because that's what we're selling, basically. You know, we're selling beauty and uh, home-based products. I'm going to hire the cashiers, too. He was fired. These were these kids were all fired. We're hiring, hiring them back for positions here at our wonderful store. Uh, yeah, and then, yeah, okay. That's set to the right time. We need one stock clerk. You will do just dandy. Um, then everything's good, right? Wait, is it? No, wait. I There's something else I wanted to put in here. Right, 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 right. The, uh, the, what, what you call it? The trash can. That's right. I'm going to put one in there. We actually need one in here, don't we? Put it in right there. So now we're not leaving trash all over the floor. And, uh, it's a great thing for everybody. This store does not look good. I did not design this store well. But you know what? That's okay, because design doesn't matter to me as long as we're efficient doesn't matter. This isn't even efficient, which <laughs> disproves my point. But whatever, man. I just, I do what I want. Um, do I want to put in floor tiles? Holy fuck, no, I don't. I just wasted a lot of money. Ain't no way I'm putting in floor tiles. You're out of your mind. Definitely not doing that. Let's go ahead and put all of them in. As soon as you do, I'm going to pause. All right. Oh, this is going to be, you know, tedious, but whatever. It's okay. I mean, I, if we are a home-based store, we should be selling light bulbs, right? I mean, yeah, I guess. It, may, it only makes sense, really, if you think about it. Oh, this is, oh, this is tedious. I hate it when, like, I get this feeling in my toes for some reason, 
and it, it it's a it's such a weird feeling like oh my like my toes cannot be sitting still because it feels so weird it's not like pins and needles no it's different from that um it's it's just like this weird feeling and i need to be moving my toes around and it like i feel like i need to stick them in an like an ice tub or something because they're feeling weird and i don't understand it at all frankly god it feels weird yeah that's exactly what i'm feeling right now I don't know why. I'm a little confused. And I, I also don't know why I brought that up, you know, out of nowhere. But, uh, you know, it's better not to question me. You know, you just shouldn't question anything I do. You should just be perfectly okay with it, with everything I do. If I, you know, went out and, you know, I mean took some money from an old lady or something you know don't question i'm just you just gotta trust me because i'm not doing anything wrong you just gotta trust me which actually reminds me last night i watched the wolf of wall street yeah the wolf of wall street that's a fucking weird movie man (laughs) it was a weird movie it was a it was like a mix of an autobiography and a drama, and I don't know actually how much of it was truthful, but it's a weird movie. Of course, Leo DiCaprio did an amazing job, but like, it was a weird movie. Like, it, there was just something about it. Like, half the fucking movie was, you know, naked women and sex and all this fantastic stuff. That's like that was like half of the movie, and you know it just, it just, <laughs> it felt so unrealistic, um, which I guess was kind of the point. Um, I don't know. It just felt like such a weird movie, you know. Oh my god, I forgot to put in the damn staff door here. Why did I forget to do that? I forgot to do that here, too. It would make things a lot easier, wouldn't it? If I took care of that. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. Don't imagine this store will get a whole lot of business, but... Yeah, it's not getting a real whole lot of business, but... Who knows? I mean, maybe it'll do a whole lot better once everything is stocked. I don't know. There wasn't a whole lot of demand for any one of the products I'm selling here, but... I mean... It's a store. <laughs> Might lose us money. I don't know. I don't know a lot of things. At all. Um... But this is where we're going to leave the episode. Um, So we built the second store. It's pretty neat. Uh, Just kind of like waiting to see how much success it will have or lack thereof. Um, So I guess we'll find out next episode. Uh, But if you guys are enjoying this series, let me know down in the comment section below. Like the video and share it with your friends. Let me know you want to see more of any game series I do here on the channel. Link down to the game is in the description box down below if you want to pick it up for yourself. And if you guys enjoyed this video in particular, again, all likes and comments are greatly appreciated. Uh, Subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. I play all sorts of games on my channel. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you very much. And I'll talk to you later.